Hi and welcome to a new tutorial on SOLIDWORKS. Here I continue working on the V12 engine theory and that's the part you will model. It's called Pinion DP38. The DP is a um, primitive diameter of 38. Please subscribe to the channel, activate the clutch to receive other episodes and without, and without wasting time, let's jump in. Start new file here, go to part, click OK. I will save the file on the first. I will put name pinion dp38 save it and let's start with the front plan go to circle i will start with two circles Extruded. I will use mid plan. Put five millimeter. Choose this plan. The the middle one. The front plan. Now it's the middle plan. Choose circle. A diameter here of five and let you draw this Once you finish, select all of this, go to circular sketch pattern, put six here and click OK. Now we can use trim to trim all of these. I think it's OK like that. Uh, go to extrude it. Here I am testing the best value because in the original version I used one extrude feature on the both side. Now I want to use only one extrude feature and have the same result as the original one. Now you can edit your sketch to add some uh, fillet here, but you can uh, go with the features, the fillet features. Uh, for me, I want to use the um, um, sketch fillet. Select the, the front plane again, use circle, go to this arc to have the center of the arc and draw a circle here. You can do the same thing, draw circles on each uh, center of the arc, but you have another method just to select that and with the circular pattern here you can put six and other method you can uh, use um, a circular pattern on the feature you have many methods 
to make the same thing with this software. We have a nice result here. Uh, now I will uh, make the the teeth of the um, this pinion. To do that, just draw with me the same thing. Once you finish the sketch, go to Extrude Cut and select this uh, zone, only this zone. And use Mid Plan to remove material in the both sides, as you can see here. It's okay. Now we have nice result selected and with circular pattern here. You can select in the direction something circular like this edge and make the same parameter as me here. Now we achieved the part, let's go back to the assembly part. Go to the insert component, you will find your pinion here, just click, one click, and go to mate, now you can select the surfaces, you will assembly, as you can see, just leave it, as you can see, the um, the automatic uh, constraint or mate on sideworks. Okay, that's the first assembly. I will validate from here and insert another component. This same component you can use copy on your keyboard or insert the same component. You have two methods. Oh, you can select the same uh, mate as you can see, but here you have to click and drag your component. I will add another just two mate here. And as you can see, I saved the third mate. Now we have a nice work here. Now we arrive to achieve the part. People, I will tell you to see you in the next episode. Let me know on the comment if it's difficult for you. Please subscribe, like and share the tutorial. Cheers!